Hello, welcome all. This is Cloud Strife with a little uh, Project Gordon, and um, we are at Cerubal Hills. The portal is just over this hill, and you'll walk down this hill, and this is a little area where you can have a stable, and there's a few NPCs inside, a cook, and a bard, um, and a, a few others. And they have quests, um, they have food, um, there's a cooking station, there's a, actually a fountain or a well where you can cook here and sell cooked foods for cash, um, but that's just a little overview. Right now, I am in this area, I'm going to be farming mutton off sheep, um, I'm going to be farming pork shoulders off of pigs and wild pigs as well as getting uh, boar tusks and meat um, and I'm going to be killing probably rats and uh, the rats I will eat probably just skin I actually purchased with my first amount of money a amazing animal skinning knife and a organ knife which is uh, for butchering so I have better chance at getting uh, organs, which are good for quests and uh, other things. I haven't really delved into it too much just yet, but I will eventually. So right now, we're just uh, going to be farming these animals and seeing what we can uh, do to uh, get our skills up and just gather materials for... Uh, making money later. As you can see, um, let's see here, I am level 11 with sword and I am level 11 with uh, unarmed and I can take on two sheep at once so um, that's not too bad. I have just basic equipment. Um, let's do butchering, autopsy. Uh, the, the things you will need to do what I'm doing is either a skinning knife or a butchering knife or the amazing or the organ knife whichever you can get a hold of um, skinning knives are a little bit later in the game than start uh, you can get those at edible just to cover cover that um, there are only 22 councils so they're pretty cheap but you gotta be able to make it there um, what else do I want to overview um, yeah, just, I have the basic starter equipment, really, um, and a sword and a shield, um, not too much. If I take off my shield, that opens up these combos a little bit, but I keep my shield on, and I just use the kick at least once to get my, uh, unarmed skill. And you will need a saw, where's my saw, and a shovel, and an autopsy kit if you want to be doing everything I'm doing here um, and all those together is probably going to cost you somewhere in the rounds of four to five probably five to five fifty maybe six hundred um, councils so what you will want to do is my first purchase I always grab when starting a new character is a butchering knife you can get those in Cerubal and you'll make pork shoulders by butchering pigs and um, once you get the pigs butchered enough you get like I don't know 30 or 40 butchered meat um, or pork shoulders what you'll want to do is make honey ham I stress this uh, you can sell the honey ham for four, uh, 10 stat for 400 uh, councils to either the Feynor, which is the cook in Zerubal, or to, oh, I don't know the character's name. He's he's the bar tendant or cook in this building right here. Um, so you can make a quick 5K in probably, I don't know, two to three hours worth of play. 
if you really hunt a lot of pigs and you cook them real quick um, I'm not gonna delve too much into it um, I've covered it in other videos so if you've watched my videos you'll know how to do it but I do cover it in every video just in case someone hasn't seen uh, my other videos um, so yeah I'm just gonna be doing a little farming here we're gonna be getting as much done as possible here and the mutton I can't actually cook that yet I haven't even cooked that with my main character yet I don't know where to get the actual mutton um, recipe or if it's a uh, higher level recipe I just have overlooked at the two places which is here in the hills and um, also in um, Zerubal so I haven't really looked too much into that but I'd like to get a mutton recipe uh, so I could cook mutton but I don't usually if I if I'm farming sheep I don't gather the mutton but I'm gathering it right now on this tune because I'd like to gather some and have a good stockpile for when I get the ability to cook it alright one thing I've been forgetting to do with this character is I want that we're gonna kill this sheep but we're gonna put that on and we're gonna kill this sheep that'll get my um, aid first aid skill up uh, or oh no I don't have first aid going up uh, armor patching uh, if you have heal kits then you can do first aid I don't have any heal kits on me so I can't really do first aid right now which it kinda of bothers me but it doesn't I'll get to it eventually once I start some quests up or just buy a heal kit then I can do it and as you can see my sword skills going up quite fast unarmed um, it's not going up uh, too quickly I think it's because I'm not using it too much I'm forgetting to kick that should make it go up my unarmed skill is actually a little bit behind my sword skill because I leveled up my sword skill to move so there we go we'll take that uh, butcher rudiment anatomy went up and we'll show you right here that's the filling that's the water well for that Ooh, a pig in here we'll kill this Ooh, I just seen a quest for um, Ooh, I skinned it that's okay what we get a rough skin a shoppy skin that's cool uh, we'll need those anyways but I was going to uh, farm the pork shoulders for a while um, that's okay we'll need it okay when they have this crown above them they have a quest and that quest is once you kill this particular creature the quest will open up and it and you will have to kill ten more of that creature and you'll get a bonus to some stuff to XP and stuff um, we're gonna skin that we don't really butcher the meat off the rats um, I don't know if they have any type of cooking things for the rat meat it'd be nice if they did I haven't really checked into it I don't think they do but they might um, so that's something I haven't checked too much into um, so for now what I will do is skin those uh, Ooh, strawberries I wonder if I have high enough level to get those yes I do we will take them all right let's kill this sheep there's some mushrooms over here we'll gather those there's so many crafting there's so much in this game I haven't delved into um, and um, I would like to delve into it more I'm taking a breather from my main character because he's exhausted his funds he has about 200 councils and uh, he has nowhere to really make money at the moment 
um, in the areas that he's at. What the heck? I thought I was clicked on it. Um, so, uh, he's taking a break until some of his money ability, some of his money refreshes, which is, I think, four days. So we'll play this character for a little bit. This character needs to get some of uh, the actual uh, favors up for some of its area. So we'll we'll continue to do that. Oh, I obtained one mushroom for that quest. That's good. <laughs> Died of bleeding. Uh, we're butchering that. We want the mutton. We'll take that. Uh, this is a sheep. Butcher it. I'd like to see something. I think I will add a suggestion where you can get like uh, maybe shears or something or something like that. And when you kill a sheep, you can harvest its wool instead of just getting the wool as a chance piece because I'd like to see the ability to get wool instead of butcher or skin well maybe if they added like skinning you could do skinning and they would give you like a, a chance at getting wool or maybe when you skin you get the wool that'd be nice Okay, Skinny has reached level 5. Let's see what we got there. We got a shoppy. Okay. Alright, what do we got here? Junk, junk. Oh, uh, that's not too bad. Nothing too fancy that I need. Alright, we got some mushrooms over here. We'll grab those up. More pigs. And a rat. And a fire sheep. We're going to kill that fire sheep, I think. Alright, we're going to butcher that. Oh, I forgot to autopsy it. Oh, he caught me on fire. Ooh, we got a coin. That's good. Butcher... I botched the butchering. Oh, no mutton for me. Alright, where's that rat? Right there. Bingo, I killed 10 rats. Uh, so I got 250 XP for that. Which is a decent amount of starter XP for you. Ooh, skin. I do not want to get the meat from him. Let's go kill this pig and this sheep. Oh, there's another sheep. skin that and see what we get we get a shabby from it so that's just a little one we'll butcher from now on all right so we've got 15 mutton that's not too bad I'm big into gathering animal hides and butchering and cooking right now I like archery a lot. Sword is fun too, but I like archery a lot. That is something um, my main character does a lot of. Um, I like animal handling. Unarmed, I haven't delved too much into, but this character is the one character that I'm leveling up my unarmed down right now. 
I can level it up on my other tune if I want as well, but I haven't really as of right now. So, but that is uh, something I may do later. Smoked him pretty quick there. And our first oak wood harvest for this map. Now, you can find oak wood on this particular map area quite frequent when you get out in certain areas. Um, it's good to get gather that too. You will need a saw, which you can purchase from the gardener in um, Cerebule. Cerebule, I mean. Or Cerebule, how you are. Cerebule, yeah. What do we have here? Looks like some kind of farm or something. I don't think I've been here even with my main tune. So we're going to see if there's any quests over here that we can grab up. Foraging is now level 7. That's good. I think I've played this character somewhere around 6 hours. I bought the game last Saturday night and I've already put in like 45 hours. Actually it's about 47 now because I've been playing 2 hours today so actually it might be 48 hours I was at so it's I've been playing it quite a bit. It's a $40 game but um, if you are an Oh, I've been to this one. It's got the uh, black widows in the in the barn. Um, if you have played games like EQ, um, Ashron's Call, any of those type of games, you'll enjoy this type of game. And it's kind of got an older feel to it. But the thing I like about this game the most is it doesn't handhold you. It's old school MMORPG where you actually have to delve into the storyline. You have to pay attention to, to chats. You don't get uh, arrows that lead you to the next quest. Uh, it's just, it's like you have to figure things out. And I like that about the game because, oh, because it gives it, it's nostalgic for me and it gives it more appealability for me because you actually have to work and think and process things to get farther in the game. You have to actually figure things out. It's not just done so you can get to max level real, real fast and stuff. What's over there? A fire sheep. You actually have to figure things out and uh, it gives it that good feel for me. I like the feel of that. All right, ooh, feathers, like that. Butcher chickens. I think I'm gonna add something to a suggestion where, um, I think I said this before, when you actually skin a chicken, you have the ability to get flowers. Or, not flowers, feathers. Why did I say flowers? Um, so I might actually do something like that. I guess I said that because I saw flowers. Alright. And we'll butcher. There's another fire sheep over there. We're going to go kill him. And we're going to kill this wild chicken. I mean, they give you feathers. So, I mean, it's not a big deal. But it would give you the opportunity to get them every time if you wanted them. Instead of getting a chance at it. So, I mean... Uh, maybe I won't suggest it because you can still get the feathers pretty often and they're not too hard to get a hold of. You can actually buy them for making arrows in, I think, thousand stacks at, oh, what character is it? Uh, it's one of the characters in Zerubal. Ooh, that's a good catch I got, or a good stash that I picked up. This stuff is fire dust, and that's used in fire mage skills. 
And I think that makes somewhere around 15 I have of those. I'm saving them up for when I do fire magic with one of my characters, which is probably going to be my main tune. Ooh, looky there, I got a spleen. A spleen. What went up? Rodent anatomy and compassion. Someone's over here. There's a dead spider. Black Widow. Someone's over here. Too bad they didn't have PvP in this game, but I'm glad they don't in a sense because PvP might ruin it for me. I'm more of a PvE type player and um, what is this? An apple tree. And I like the fact that it's a straight PvP PvE. Um, I don't know if there's any Guild Wars or anything like that, but PvE makes it more friendly, and I do like that about it. I don't know if they're going to put PvP content into this game or not, but I think it might make the game not appealing to me, and I like the fact that it's not PvP, so... At least that I've f delved into or found out about. I think it's straight PvE, which is straight fine with me. So, this guy's going to take a little bit to kill. Alright, let's see. We got a spider leg. Let's kill this sheep. Kick ya. I guess you get enough wool, you don't have to really have the ability to get wool on your skin. And the same thing with the feathers, so um, I think I'll leave that suggestion in the forget about it box. I have made a few suggestions to them about butchering though, and I think, yeah, I think it was just butchering. I'd like to see them add something to butchering where as your skill goes up you get more of the meats from the animals like you could get um, instead of just getting mutton you could get like different parts of the animal like for pigs you could get pork shoulders and you could get like like the hams for the backs but that would change the whole aspect of the game. I don't know if they'll do that. Um, ooh, a deer. This looks like a rich deer territory. It is. And there's uh, one of the quest deer down there. This is... Oh, this is deer haven. I have not found this before. But look at all these deer. They're everywhere. And a wild pig. Let's kill that wild pig. Where are we at? I don't think I, I've never been over here even on my main character. So this is a new honey hole for hunting deer. Killed that wild pig. Got 43 XP for it too. We're gonna butcher him. Oh, gotta get my leg down. Alright, let's see how much we got here. Alright, we've got 23 mutton, 28 hams, so we want to keep going. I don't think I'm going to hunt any of these deer, really. I'll let them all go off and do the bingo. There's some wood. Oh, we're going to kill the sickly tiger, though. I would love to hunt the deer. It's just the deer are hard to hunt unless you have a bow with uh, barbed arrows. Let's skin this. All good, we gotta hide off of it. Let's get this wood. We're gonna have to eat something soon. We don't have snacks really, I don't think. Maybe I have some snacks. Yeah, I do have snacks. I've prepared snacks. 
but we'll wait to eat the snack until uh, I need food so we can keep it even Steven with the snacks and the food oh goody um, let's butcher that I botched the butchering um, I noticed that I botched the butchering a lot less with lower levels with the amazing skinning knife than the just skinning knife um, so as soon as I can make some money on my main character Oh, actually, with my main character, I did buy one of the uh, skinny knives, but I didn't get the butchering, uh, the knife, the organ knife. I didn't get that. I'm going to purchase one of those at the shop, um, a player shop, and it's 700 councils for it, and the amazing skinny knife, and they're great. I love them. We're going to kill this fire sheep and finish our fire sheep quest. And we'll see how much XP we get for that. And hopefully we'll get a fire dust off this guy. Three fifty to sword and unarmed. Both. Uh, and fifty for anatomy. So that's good. That's good. We're going to butcher that. I botched the butchering. Let's kill the sheep. Now there's some sheep in this area. There's a good amount of sheep in this area. Oh, I skinned him. I was going to take the mutton, but I skinned him. Kicked him back. What is this? 10 and 10. Eh, it's not really that big of a deal. I can sell it. I've seen some really good quality 25, 25 pieces. Or that's about the highest I've really gathered or picked up. I think the highest one I had was 268 value. And the only way to really sell those is to sell them to players. You, otherwise, you can only make about a hundred at the shop off of them. So, uh, my power is not gaining very fast at all. I'm using it quite quickly. I've noticed with this sword character. All right, let's see how much button we got. Twenty-eight. We're at 28 and 28. There was a quest spider over here. There's a player. Right over here. Let's go say hi. There's two players, actually. Or is that... No, that's actually... Uh, that's not a player. Where are we at? I think there's a quest for these guys. I wonder how tough it is to kill that guy. Let's see. Oh, I know who these are. I don't want to mess with that just yet. I think I'll die. And I'm out here and about here, so I won't. don't want to die. Although you get XP for dying. There's no real penalties for dying, which I do like too. This is a very nice game for just enjoying yourself and playing something where you can progress in and learn and just have fun with friends it's not it's competitive a little bit competitive in the fact that you can compete uh, trade wise and uh, you can uh, just see maybe you could be competitive to see who can get the skills the fastest or uh, whatever you don't have to but it, it is competitive trade wise um, which is good. In the main HUD town, you can set up shops, which I have yet to do. There's a few open stands, and I would like to do it. Um, I just have to figure out how to get industry up with either one of my characters. I haven't figured out how to do it yet. Um, I think you have to start with work orders, and I'm going to be doing work orders. I just haven't gotten to the ability to do it yet. 
with uh, any of my characters. So I have some work orders actually on this character. Let's see here. Skill, no, not skill. Uh, quest log, work orders. These are the work orders I purchased, and the oak dolls and the wood chips are probably going to be the two I'm going to be doing the most. Now, if I do the arrows, like the beginner long arrows, I could get that relatively soon. But you can see there that you can make almost 7k doing that. Now, if you can actually produce everything to make those arrows, um, why is, no, that's the wrong one. Okay, there it is. Okay, you can make 911, sorry, for beginner long arrows. So if you can produce or craft everything in it and gather materials yourself, it's straight profit. It's straight profit. You'll make 911 profit. So... Uh, let's see how many five we've gotten five oak wood which isn't too bad there's the bill you can it, there's a place where you can get more um I know there's a place that I hunt south south uh, west southwest on the map where you get a lot of oak Hey, kitty kitty, what you want, kitty kitty? Mushrooms, we'll go pick those up. There's that spider. I should do the quest for him. There's a lot of spiders around here. And I think I will, because it's going to be easy XP. Let's get this apple tree. Alright, we're going to kill this guy. Black Widow, you're going down. Yep, now I have the quest. Ooh, he dropped a good item. Ooh. It's only worth 89, though. It's not really high value, but it is actually a rare piece of equipment. But it doesn't look like it's that big of a deal. I think purple is the highest... I've seen and rarity. And those come in all brackets of armor, weapons, jewelry, and stuff, so. Uh, let's butcher that. What are you doing, cat? You playing with that? You ain't gonna play with that, you turn. Leave that alone. I don't want you batting that all over the house. Oh, good. Found an area with some sheep and pigs. Now, that over there, you see that blue light? That is the spider cave in this area. Um, it's a good place to hunt and make XP and get equipment. Um, caves are the best place to get equipment. Um, and XP really like you can just kill and kill and kill and get lots of loot and there's usually like some kind of there's actually um, I think it's the gold goblets that you can loot in there and you can get several of them in in spawns so and those are worth uh, 50 councils a piece so I mean if you need some money and you can sell those Go ahead, or if you need them to give to, um, there's a NPC in, uh, Zerubal, Zerubal that you can give, uh, those gold goblets to for a favor. When I first started, uh, gold goblets, I, I saved those to sell because they were worth 50 but I quickly learned that you sell and gather so much of them that um, it doesn't really matter to sell all of them once you sell enough to dissipate his uh, the NPC's ability to buy them from you his money it's just easy to gift them so I just gift them 
I make most of my money off of armor, weapons, jewelry, and uh, cooked food. So, cooked food is the most probable use that for me. Um, but right now, I can't make any money until it resets. So I have to wait for it to reset on my main character anyways, and this character. Um, but when it resets on my main character, in Zerable, my main character has such good favor with Feynor that he can get $10,000 uh, uh, from her for selling stuff to her. So he will be selling a lot of honey ham and other cooked foods to her when she resets and he'll have 10 grand from that. I got another fire dust and a fire quest. I should start trying to, I don't get the meat from that fire um, animal or a fire sheet. What is that? Oh, I know where we're at. I don't think I want to head there just yet. This character is too low for that. Oh, looky there. I turned around and there's some oak. Perfect. I need that. And our ham situation. Oh, we're level 14 on butchering now. Oh, no, it's not. It just looked like it. It's not. Dang, I thought I had some wood. There's a pig. We're going to kill this pig. I love pigs, wild boars, deer, tigers. I love all the animals because you can get so much stuff from all of them the way they've made this game. They've been very intricate with this game and you can really it some aspects remind me of some of the newer types of games, but some aspects remind me of the older games like the actual gameplay um, and style of it is older style, but the it's got it's got a lot of it's got a mix variant for me of the the type of games I play, and I really enjoy it a lot. That spider's coming. Ooh, what do we have here? Oh, that's good. 15 sword, 15 unarmed. That could be a good weapon when I get to 15 and 15. So there we go. I got a decent weapon now. And I didn't have to buy it for an ungodly amount of cash. Uh, what is this? Oh, I know where we're at. We're back uh, at the start. Here's an apple tree. And there's another apple tree. We're going to harvest these. We're almost out of our food. So we're going to have to eat some more food. And I saved honey ham for that. Um, I did eat... We're going to actually eat the crab and see how that works for a while. Um, but I ate some cooked clownfish. I made some fillets and did that. Uh, I just passed that apple tree, didn't I? Is that the apple tree I did the first time? No, I don't think it is. Good, good. There's an apple tree down here. We'll grab that. There's an apple tree over there. You can farm apple trees here. What is... Oh, that's one of them. Uh, okay, I know what that is. It's one of the unarmed, like... Shrines or something. Oh, I can kill spiders. I haven't been killing them. I've been avoiding them. I want to kill those. I have a quest for them. Bingo. Smoked him. Cloud Strife. I can't believe I got that name. 
I can't believe I got that name. I would think that major MMO RPGers would have taken that name, but I got that name. That's great. Shout out to Final Fantasy 7. That game is my favorite game of all times. Oh, what do we get here? 23 armor. Um, let's look at what we have for pants. Actually, yeah, that's great. We're going to put that on. Okay, we're going to move that up here to right here. And this, we're going to move down the cell. We're going to move this to right here so we don't sell that. Oh, what do we have here? A webbed hat, too. Uh, we're getting some... What, what does this one do? 23, 5, negative 5 to power. So what's this do? That's the same thing. Okay. We'll just sell that for some cash, then. Actually, there is one tune I can make money off of on my main character. He's, he can get 7.5k from him, but he has to sell armor and weapons only to him. Um, I'd have to hunt a dungeon and do it. It'd be kind of tedious, too, because I'm not quite leveled up enough to hunt the dungeons yet that I, I can hunt that I know of. Is that a black widow? That's a black widow. We're gonna kill it. These spider legs are good. I can make some money off of them. I'll pick them up. Oh, look at he spawned right away. I'm hungry. I'm gonna eat that crab meat. Where's that crab meat? That'll give us one more slot. And we got level two on that now. As you can see, I haven't ate many different foods. Most foods last an hour, or so you you don't eat but every hour of gameplay, so. Alright, seven more spiders, that's not too bad, and then I'll have a quest complete for that. Here's another one. Oh, I think he poisoned me. What do we got here? You feel lonely and isolated, negative, oh, come on. Negative 1% XP. Salt. We'll take salt. Okay, that went away. Oh, I got lice. Ew. What's... Cast from a pig. I got lice from a pig. I didn't know you could get lice from a pig. Well, I mean, obviously you can, but... 
two more spiders. There's a log. We'll grab that up. We'll kill these spiders real quick here. I didn't even see how much we got for that. 125, so that's not too bad. Ooh, we got a weapon. An unarmed weapon. That's cool. And some armor. And we finally stopped being poisoned. From venom. And let's get that log while we can. Alright, let's see here. Let's take off this shield. We're going to move the shield down to here. This we're going to save because we're going to wear later. So we'll put that up there. And this, can I use it? Yes, I can. We're going to put this right next to this. And we're going to equip that. Oh, you, uh, maybe not. Oh, what is it? Alright, let's see what the... Unarmed 3 damage. Nah. We'll just keep it how it is. Because I can level them both up. That'd be nice if that could be an offhand. So I could use both. Uh, maybe they'll change that. I don't know. Uh, wait a minute. What's going on here? Oh, I can punch. Kick. And use my sword. Oh, that's because I took my shield off. I might leave it like that so I can actually do uh, more skills to gain. I might want my shield on just because it's more defense. Uh, where did I put my shield? Let's put that shield back up there. We'll hold on to the unarmed weapon while I'm in combat. In case I want to level up that. Ooh, some gloves. Let's see here. What do we want to drop? We will drop that. Take that. And we are full up now. So we need to sell and all that. So we're going to head back to Zero Bowl. Alright. Well, it's still early. We got plenty of... I'm lonely. I'm lonely. wonder if I'll pass this guy. If I'll get friends. Slaughter of countless foes. Jeez. Lonely and isolated. I don't even know how to fix that. That's something I'll have to figure out. Negative 1% XP. That's not a lot, but it adds up. I mean, everything adds up. It's a little chilly in here. I might get a sweatshirt on. I think my heat's up good, but... There we go. That'll keep us a little warmer. Maybe we'll throw on a hat too. And my slippers. I forgot about those. Then we'll be warmer. A hat, sweatshirt, and some slippers. Oh wow, this is taking a long time to load. There must be a lot of people on. Uh, should have been loaded already. There we go, it's going now. Alright, there we go. Now we're a little bit warmer. Uh, 
I haven't seen what the unarmed pants look like. Actually, the ranger type pants. Oh, they look kind of cool now. That's interesting. It meshes together good with my other armors. I like how they've made it cohesive like that. Alright, let's see here. 19 shabby furs. Almost 50 hams. 30 mutton about. We got a rough hide. We got one tusk. We're going to save that. We need to save as many tusks as we can for uh, the bard quest. We got a bunch of those. So... I need four more of those to complete a, ta uh, a quest, which I'm going to try and complete, which is, I'll show you right here, quest log, it's going to be either this, or it's going to be this, I think this pays more, yes it does, so we're going to do that, and besides that I want to do some archery, so I could use those, so... Unless I, I fill the order and I don't... No, if I fill the order, he'll probably take the dowels, but that's okay. Um, 450. Man, I wish they'd give you more for that. Just to make dowels from the NPC is like... I think, or to buy them is a thousand bucks to get ten of them. But I'm glad they do that because they make the game not easy, which makes it more challenging to play, which is good. You actually, actually have to put in the work to make the money instead of just go to NPC, buy real low, and then do it that way. It makes it more probable or useful for someone to actually go out and hunt. Oh, I killed someone's pet. Oh, let's check something here. Skin. We'll drop that a second. We'll butcher. Do that. Then we'll pick that bone up. What is that? Beginner arrow. Oh, it just disappeared. Now, if that was a stack of beginner arrows, I would have loved to have that. I have two beginner arrows right here. I don't even know why I have that in my inventory. Alright, we're going to see here. We're going to give gift. We're going to give that. We're going to give that, as long as that's not a big deal. Oh, uh, what is it? Oh, that's not too bad, actually. That would, That's a good unarmed piece if I wanted to use my unarmed. Let's hold... Well, what's my unarmed level at? 14. By the time I decide to use unarmed solely, I might be higher level. Uh, we'll, we'll hold off on that. Staff damage, we'll get rid of that. What's this one? Sword, heart, flash, max health. That's good. So let's put that right there. And what is this? That's not even that bad. Can I use either one of these yet? I can use that one. Hmm. I do want to replace this one with this or this. But maybe not this unless I'm going to be straight leveling up my unarmed skill. So we'll hold on to that. Well, maybe. Nah, we're just going to get rid of it. We're going to get rid of that. This one we'll hold on to. So we're going to put that one to be in my... Now let's go to shop. In my... Uh, we're going to sell that, sell that, sell that. 
sell that, sell that, and sell that. We're gonna hold on to that one until I'm level 15. So now we're at 3,000 councils. All right, and I can still make four grand off her, 4,300 off her, 4,340, which is good. All right, let's come over here. We've got these work orders that we really don't need on this character, but I bought them for my other character. Let's see, give gift. What can I give to this guy? Ha. Huh. Not very much. Let's check what else he takes. Prepared foods. So, we're going to prepare these and we're going to give those to him. That should that should push us over into comfortable with him. So, now we're going to go to storage. We're going to check, we're going to add these. We're going to add these. We're going to add the egg. We're going to add the mutton. Where's the mutton? That gives us a good amount of mutton. Um, we're going to add the strawberries, we're going to add the apples, alright, we're stockpiling food right now, which is good, these two items, I don't know if I'm going to stockpile too much, um, because I can't gather them right now, but I will get them from various creatures, alright, I think that's it for all that, um, Let's organize that. Oh, it is already organized. Okay. Chicken. We're going to... We want chicken. So, okay. I was going to say. Good. So, we got 14 chicken. Okay. We got a perch here. Let's throw that in there. I think that's everything. What do we got here? Beginner, I might as well pick it up. All right, let's go to storage. All right, um, the boar tusk we're gonna hold on to right now. Now I have a lot of storage here still. Um, let's check this one real quick. I have a good amount of storage here, so we can fill one order now. One order. So we're going to fill an order. So we're going to withdraw that. We're going to split. Um, we're going to do one. And the order we're going to have to fill is going to be the chips. The chip, uh, what is it called? Chip oak. Because dowels, if I remember right, take two oak to make. So we're going to have to do that. We're going to put that in storage, we're going to put that in storage, put that in storage. Um, what else do I want to put in storage here? This. Let's check here real quick. Feathers we'll put in there. Uh, we'll put the spleen in there. Do I have a mandrake anywhere? Alright, mandrake root we'll put in there. Uh, let's see, coin, coin. Do I have coin anywhere? This coin is going to come in handy. We're going to put that in there. Actually, I well, I need that for our quest, if I remember right, but I haven't done the quest just yet. Let's keep checking. Let's put... We're going to sell that key, maybe. Well, we'll put it in storage until we find out what it's for. Alright, so sorting through this all, it looks good. Looks good. Let's actually put these scales in here too. We're going to save those because I think they're used for later. And we have two storage slots left. We're going to throw this in one. And what is this? And we're going to throw that in the other, I think. So we might use that later. Okay, that's good. Now the rest of this we can either craft with or sell and use. 
Oh, I actually have one more spot. Uh, what else do we want to put there? Anything else? Let's put... What do we have here? Let's put... We already have these memorized, so... Those are for my other tune. They're just taking up space, though. I should just sell them. I should just sell them. These, I don't want to sell, but... This and this, I don't care about, really. But we're going to do something different here. We're going to take this key back. We're going to hold on to that. We're going to put the snare arrow in storage and that in storage. So we'll get those to my other character later. Somehow, hopefully. Alright, we're going to come in here. We're going to come to this craft now these are all the craftable stuff I can do we're looking for chipped right here oak wood chips and we're gonna do ten of those carpentry level one <laughs> level two so this is important to level up this is the first thing you're gonna want to level up with uh, carpentry level three so I got three levels out of that. Now, I think, um, that might put me up. Let's check here. I think I need more levels for anything, but we're going to check training just to see. Okay, learn fletching. I still need to get comfortable with him to learn fletching. So I can't really make arrows yet for him, but I have carpentry learned. So that's good. Um, let's see here. This goblet is worth 50 bucks. And I want to sell it for 50 bucks because I need the money right now on this character instead of gifting it. But I believe this is the character you gift it to. Yes, it is. Uh, heck, we'll gift that to him. Zero favor, nice. We'll gift that. One point, some odd favor. Alright, now we're going to go to shop. Sell. We'll keep in the wool. We'll sell that. Sell that. Keep that. Sell that. Sell that. Sell that. Okay. Training. What else can I train with this character? Nothing but stuff starting to open up. Alright. I'm kind of jumping everywhere here. Selling as I go. Alright. We're going to go to this guy. We're going to go to storage real quick. We're going to check the storage. We got wool right there. So we're going to put that in storage. I've got 21 wool. Actually... I'm going to withdraw that. So. Okay. So we don't have too much. Oh, we want to sell that. Talk to him. Shop. Sell. We're going to keep that. Do we want to keep that? Yeah, we'll keep that. Oh, I forgot to even look at that. Can I put that on yet? No. So we're going to want to store that. So we'll just sell that storage we'll check her good we can store that and that opens up actually we're gonna keep that on us and we're gonna store that so we'll put that right up there we'll put these down here alright oh look at there now that I'm in town I have some friendship What'd someone drop here? Simple armor patch? I'll take that. I can use them. I gotta start doing my armor patching too. Now we're gonna talk to this person. We're gonna give gift. And we're gonna give her all our hides. 
we want to get her favor up. I think. Let's check. Small talk. She takes rare recipes too. And that she hates me. She loves rare recipes. She likes animal skin. So animal skins aren't the best for her. But veggie dishes and rare recipes are. So I could actually get better uh, favor if I give her the love stuff, but that's okay. Oh, you want to turn around? Could I ask a favor? Who's asking a favor? Where was that person? <laughs> Someone's trying to get cotton from someone. Alright, we're gonna cook up this uh, beef. Trade. So we've got 50 beef. Okay, you've reached higher favor. Cool. Shop. Can I sell? No, I can't. Buy? I can buy? Okay, so 50, I need 150, so let's go 150, 210, 210, um, do I want more water bottles? I think I want more water bottles, so I could cook these faster. I love having 10 water bottles minimum. Five is just too many trips, so I'm going to spend 500 bucks and get some water bottles. Which is going to put me under 3,000 again, but that's okay. Alright, shop. Water bottles, we want five of those by all right now we've got ten now as you can see they stack in two five sets I'd like to see them stack in ten sets but I don't know why they do that I think they do it to prevent people from stacking like hundreds of waters just to do cooking way faster I think they want people to actually work at it instead of do things quicker so it's kind of frustrating but it's actually a good thing so now we can cook 10 of these at a time so we're going to come over here we're going to cook our honey hams put it on repeat cooking level 12 10 of those done. Now we just gotta go refill our sugar. Give gift. Hmm. I might do a favor request for her. This reminds me reminiscent of when I first started the game a week ago, about a week ago. A little less than a week ago, but... I could be doing other things on my main character. I just... I wanted him to do a favor quest, so I'm doing a favor quest, so... 
I'm playing this character for a little bit. And it's fun to play. It's it's fun for me to do things over and over and learn new tricks and just play the game and enjoy it for what it is. So I don't mind it. I've got some salt. I've got some salt. Oh, I didn't sell that goblet. I still have to sell that goblet. I'm going to go sell that goblet. I got to sell that at Marna. So. As you can see, this goes a lot. Oh, I forgot to fill one. That's okay. I'm not going to do it this time because I have 9 and 10. A 9 and 19 or a 9 and a 10 stack, so that's fine. So we'll just do this. Maybe we can get our favor up high enough to where we can make money again. I've noticed that sometimes when you re get their favor up, it resets and you can sell to them, and sometimes it doesn't, so it might be bug in the game. I'm not sure, so... I don't know how that mechanic is supposed to work, so... We need some higher level dishes. 13. Good. We're at 13 level. We need to get some higher level cook dishes to make more XP. Alright, there we go. We're going to leave these empty so they stack. Now, trade. We're going to go to training real quick here and check. I could learn how to make baked potatoes, but that would not be a lot of XP. Bacon would be good. And I could make bacon. Baked chicken? We want that, so we're going to learn that. That cost us a little bit of money, but that's okay. We want the baked chicken, because baked chicken is a very simple dish to make. And, uh... It only takes salt and the chicken meat, and that is it. And you can make baked chicken. So we're going to put this down here. We're going to replace that with the baked chicken because the baked chicken is a better uh, food item. So we're going to come here to storage. We're going to take all those out. And I think I can, I'll can. i take those out as well because I can make those. We're going to make some apples and some chicken. So we're going to need some more sugar. I think it's one part sugar, I think. We'll need some more water, too. Uh, let's see here. Shop. Sugar. We'll just buy that many. Alright. We're going to cook. We're going to go to candy apple. Let's see what I need. I need two and water. So I need oh, we're going to need 15 of those. So let's buy can I buy? I probably can't. Can I buy 14 of those? No, nope, I didn't think so. We'll buy 15. So I'll have one extra sugar it looks like. Fill up my bottle of water, and then we'll make some more candied apples. Fill up. Fill, 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 fill. 
you're getting cooking lessons. And as you can see, my money is starting to go down quite a bit. As you progress, um, your money goes down quite fast when you start buying recipes or skill or not skills, recipes and um, equipment for recipes or items for recipes I should say like sugar and stuff it'll go down shortly sugar's relatively inexpensive but if you can't sell back to the NPC because you're on a reset timer then you're not making money so you might want to stockpile a little while until it resets alright now we need four water that's all we want to fill so we can have empty bottles It'll give us one more inventory spot. Cook. Those are worth 12 XP. Those are a little more than the honey ham. Okay, now we're going to... Did we buy the baked chicken? Yes, we did. So we've got four, so we need ten. Perfect. That means when we cook them, inventory will be nice and clear. Okay, so we're going to go with shop. Salt. We want two of those. Salt's a little more pricier. And we're going to cook all those. And as you can see, those are worth 20 XP, so they're worth a lot more. Cooking's 14. Alright, now we're going to put that up there. And we might hold on to that just because I like the chicken more than the honey ham. Now we're going to trade with this person. We're going to go to gift. We're going to gift that. Boom. 25 favor. 25 favor. 25 favor. 25 favor. We're going to get our favor up real good here. And I want her to have as much favor as I can before the reset, before I reset her, or before she resets, because when she resets, it then she'll have even more money. So let's see here. Right now, she will reset to 2500 and that's it. So if I can get this up another notch, I think she'll reset to five grand. so I'll be able to make more. So it's important to gift while you can, but you have to utilize your money until it resets. Otherwise, you'll be in a deep doo-doo because you won't have any money. All right. Let's come over here. We're going to sell that goblet to her. Shop. Sell. And we're going to sell this goblet. Oh, we can sell the chicken to her. Hmm. Do we want to sell the chicken? We can make a lot of money. We can sell those apples, too. Oh, wow. Well, I'll sell that chicken. We'll sell that chicken because 10 seconds, 10 seconds is fine. And let's see what else we can sell here. The cheese we can make a lot off of. Nah, the grass not so much. But we'll sell the grass because I don't want that. We'll sell the goblet. And let's we'll sell the sugar to keep it out of my inventory for an extra slot. That cheese, I do want to sell that cheese to her. 
but I'd rather keep her for just extra stuff that I need to sell. So we'll hold off on that. Now we should be all set. We need to go to the docks, so we need to go this way. We're going to fill this order at the docks. And we'll get a little bit of money for that. Probably not a lot, but it'll be something. Let's swim. Ooh, there's a crab. Boom, 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 boom. We're going to grab that crab because he's good. Fishing one up. I think this is a clownfish. We're going to grab this. Deliver to Fitz the Boatman. So it's showing that my order is filled for the 10 chips. So we're going to go fill that. I can't get those fish yet. We're going to kill this. And we're going to hope for some chicken. Nope, we got a feather. But we still get some chicken doing that. Let's kill this rat. Take, skin it. Boom, boom, we'll kill this rat. Take, skin it, skin it. We're going to see exactly how much we get for that fill order which I don't think is much I think it's 148 councils but it's something and it'll get my industry started and I think that's what I'm gonna have to start with my other characters so if that particular fill order is still there I'm gonna buy it actually I'll buy the uh, other one uh, what one is it the uh, arrow one because I can make more money if they're both there. It's been a f little bit of time, but I don't think it's been quite enough time, but it might have been, so they might not be there. If they're still there, I'm going to buy them, though, so I can fill the orders on my other character. And that's something I can do to make money on my other character. Um, that's something that will keep me busy for a little bit. If I can get, the, get them to them. And he's oh, should be just about done with this thing. Okay, how long do we have? 39 minutes. Okay, that's good. We're going to buy that and that just in case. And everything else should be good. Yep, everything else is good. We're going to go fill this order. We're going to drop all the fill orders for uh, my character. Or work orders, I should say, not fill orders. Okay, so I got 10 in industry XP. Cool. And I got 148 consoles, so that's not too bad. Now, the question is, can I fill that again? Let's look at... Uh, skills, not skills, quests. Quests. Okay, so it took it away. Ah, so you'll want to have those in large amounts. I see when you, okay, so when you fill the order, you don't memorize it. All right, let's read. We're going to buy, like, let's get 30 of these. I can't buy 30 of them? Only five at a time? Okay, so we'll do uh, four. Purchase those. We'll do three. Purchase those. Do they stack? 
they don't stack oh that's horrible they should stack oh man they should stack memorize oh you already completed it okay can I sell those no I can't <laughs> Oh boy, I bought those for no reason. So you only can do one work order per. That's uh. That's kind of bogus. So I don't need all those, even though I just purchased them. So I wasted money. And well, I can sell them to an NPC uh, in here. We'll do so. And I know what NPC I'll sell them to. It's going to be one of the storage characters, not Marna, but the Hoarder, Holgan the Hoarder, because I haven't sold him nothing, and I can sell work orders to him. I know I can. Let's go around this tiger. To level up industry is hard then. You'll have to do daily work orders to level that up. Look, a rat. I could tame him. What is this? Fish gut? Oh. Oh, I don't think I want to use that. 5% chance the knife will be destroyed. I don't like that. Take. Let's uh. Let's get a skinny level eight. Cool. Do 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 do. Oh, I almost passed the entrance. So we're going to get on our main character and start doing some industry quests and stuff, so. We're going to come over here. Actually, we're going to come in here real quick. We're going to talk. Storage. Her. We're going to take this out. Take this out and take this out. Now let's see here. That work order I do want for my main character. That one I don't have to have and that one I don't have to have. So we're going to sell everything but this one. So we're going to put that one right there. Alright. Shop. Sell. Boom, 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 boom. Oh, I sold the one. That's okay, I'll buy it with my other character. Uh, what is this? We're gonna get rid of that. We're going to talk to her. We're going to gift. We're going to give her that as a gift. Alright, and that is going to be it for this tune for a little bit. We're going to get on our main tune. Check his um, 
favor that quest that he did and then we're gonna do some work orders log in he looks pretty cool doesn't he and then here's Cobb Darth finished with the favor quest or hangout quest I should say let's see what we get Hundred fishing XP, twelve favor, and five crab. That's cool. I'm down with that. All right, let's see here. I have very little money, so we're gonna go get those quests. We're gonna buy as many of them as we need. First, uh, no, we don't want to check that. We want to go to quests, work orders. We have basic arrow, shabby stools. So. I think I might get rid of that one, I'm not sure. Because I don't think I know how to make shoppy stools. But I have to go to an NPC to learn how to make shoppy stools. So that's going to cost me some money. But if it's not too expensive, I can make some money. Alright. Now this is, oh, this is my main character. He is, right now, he is level 27 in archery. So he's, he's doing not too bad. We're going to skin these. Actually, yeah, we'll skin it. I picked up that grass. I probably shouldn't have, but that's okay. <laughs> He's getting low on arrows, I think. Yeah, I've only got 600. Let's get over here. Where are we? Yeah, we're headed away from the docks. We want to head to the docks. Is that the docks over there? No, it isn't. Or is it? Yeah, I think that is the docks. So we were headed toward the docks. Okay. So we were doing fine, but that's okay. I haven't done any fishing on this character very much, so... Ooh, we do want to take a dip, though. We need to clean ourselves. What's attacking me? A tiger. Oh, he killed it. We'll take that. We'll skin it. Good deal. Come on, rat boy. Georgie. I got a rat. A giant rat. Uh, and he's named George. Beef steak. Now, we're going to buy two specific industry things from here. One is going to be for some dowels, and the other one is going to be for the wood. So we're going to buy this and this. Nothing else are we going to buy, really, because we, don't, we can't fill it. Alright, now if we head back to town, I think we already have the, the stuff to fill this that I've actually produced. So I might be able to finish it right away. I'm pretty sure I'm close. There, now we'll get our XP for this. What is that? We'll take that. Skin him. 
It's not a lot of money, but I can sell it. There we go, we got some good XP for first aid and armor. What is that? Physical mitigation. Oh, I think that's this. No, it's not. It must be something else. It's pretty cool, though. Alright, so before we get to this tiger, we're going to do that and that. We're going to get him going. It's important to learn all the stuff you need to do to, to gain XP. So, you want to level up stuff as quickly as possible, probably. So you can do more quests. There's a lot of quests in this game too. Other than just doing the random stuff that I do. Like hunt and stuff. There's there's a lot of quests. I've probably done 20 or to 40 quests. Within the first 2 or 3 days. And um, probably more like 40. And uh. It's just like there's so many to do right in the first area and as well as the starter island. I mean, the, and when you do them, you get rewards. So, I mean, you want to do them. It's a little lake or pond. I'd say, I'd say maybe a lake. We should actually go hunting for some armor and sell armor. I think I can still sell armor. I know that's one way I can make money with this character. What do we have here? Simple armor patch? We'll pick it up. We could use it. We used one, we burnt one earlier, so we'll use it. My animal handling is almost leveled. Alright, so... We're gonna go... Uh oh, Ursula is killing somebody and they're not even paying attention. Oh, they got him. Okay, we're gonna come here. Talk to her. We're gonna go to storage. We're gonna store that store that all right what else do we want to store here what are these trophy panther skinning trophy bear and quality deer shoes we're gonna sell that we're gonna withdraw that and sell that and these two work orders we're gonna memorize all right now what can we stick in here that we want to stick in here? Maybe these gears. We'll put those in there. I don't know what they're for, but they might be useful later. Oh, let's talk sh shop. Can I sell to her? 17. That's all I can sell to her. Okay, storage. Him. Let's see what all we have in here that I can do. Wool. We'll store the wool. Okay. We've got five oak chips right now. So we're going to withdraw those. We're going to check her real quick. And we have perfect oak. But it doesn't look like we have anything else. So we're going to negate pulling that out. We're going to put that in. Oak chips are very cheap. So I might just put in an order for them. But 
I don't know. It might be easier just to go get them. I'll only need five of them. Okay, storage. This is my food storage. We're going to store this steak. Um, anything else we want to store here? Uh, we're going to take this. Well, no, we'll leave the spleen. I just have so much miscellaneous stuff on this character. Potatoes. You know what? We're going to withdraw those. We're going to make baked potatoes out of them. And we're going to put in... We're going to make the strawberries. What did I do with the strawberries? Did I drop those? I did. I don't want to drop those. Okay, uh, storage. Alright, let's see. What else do we want to store in here? Anything. We'll put that in there. And we'll put the sulfur in there. Alright. Alright. We'll, we'll cook the chicken. We'll cook the strawberries. We'll cook the apples. Oh. We want to give these shabby hides to my one person. Oh, we want to sell that and sell the grass too. So, let's go talk. Storage. Shabby hides. How many does that put me up to? 30. That's not too bad. Alright. So, work order. Do I want to sell that? Yes, I do. Alright. So, we're going to go to shop. Sell. We'll sell that. Good. 80 bucks. I needed that. I can't sell that. I think it can sell that over here. Talk. Shop. Sell. We're going to go all the way down here. Let's sell the dirt. I don't want the dirt. We'll sell the plea. And I've got 11 more. Sell the grass. Sell that. Is there anything else I want to do? No. Now my inventory is looking a little cleaner. We're going to give this up. Oh. I don't think I can fillet perch yet. But we'll keep, hold on to it. Ah, uh, where is he? Oh, he like disappeared. Oh, wow. Like, that's uh, weird. Okay, let's give him a gift. We'll give him the cat's eye. What sh can I sell to him? Lots of stuff, but I don't have anything to sell to him. He basically takes mage stuff. Uh, training. Ooh, I want that. I want that. But it's 160. We'll take it. Bingo. Now I need a staff. Oh yeah, something new to mess with now. Alright, let's go to storage. Or shop. No, not shop. Why did I come over here? I want to be over here. I want to buy a staff from him. Oh. Come here. Uh, shop. Basic staff. Bingo. Now I can mess with fire magic. Alright. Let's talk to her. Storage. Where is it? We'll take that out. And we'll put that. Uh, put it right there. We'll put that right there. And we're going to leave that for now. Now we're going to finish our cooking. Cook. 
we're gonna make the apples. Oh, I just made apple juice. That's not what I wanted to do. Uh, we'll drink it though. Alright. I want to make... Uh, where is it? Apple... Starts with a C. Candied apples. I have no more apples. Well, that's okay. I made my... Made that then. Okay. Boiled crab. I can make that. Uh, actually, I can't. Unless I buy... Uh, so let's grab something here. We're going to be out of money real quick here. Training. Okay, maybe I do have it. Do I have it? Yes, I do. Okay. Um, let's see here. I need... Um, I am not going to cook anything, really. I don't want to cook anything because I can't make any money off of it. So we're just going to fill that water bottle and call it good. Actually, I can cook one thing, my chicken. I might be able to cook that crab, I don't know. Let's check. Fried clownfish? No. Crab meat? Yeah, let's do those. And then we'll make broiled meal out of it. Alright. There we go. Now we can empty our water. Big chicken. We'll do one of those. And we still need one more crab meat. We'll make one of those. Alright, now what else can we do? Potatoes. Let's see what potatoes. I know we bought some. Potato wedges. Salt, water, and flour. We're not going to do that. That's going to cost too much. I'd have to buy too much and I need to make money. So we're going to come over here, trade. We're going to go to give gift. We're going to give that fish. We're going to give her the potatoes because I don't want the potatoes. The crab meat, I am going to eat one of them. So I can say I've ate it. I'm going to give the rest to her. Give that fish to her, um, and that's it. We're gonna drink this. Metabolism. That's what water's good for. Okay, now we're doing not too bad. We can do some fire magic stuff. So we're going to equip that. And we've got it equipped. Let's go to our skill tab and see if we can do fire magic here. Actually, we don't have the... Man, we don't have the skill, I guess. I thought I trained it. I trained fire magic thing. Let's look at quests real quick. Alright, quests and favors. We've got a lot of quests to fill. Huh. Okay, I need 10 wool for this. Okay, so if I have 10 wool, we'll grab that. And I'm pretty sure I do somewhere. Oh, no, I don't. I have 5. 
because I've gifted so much of it and sold so much of it, but we can do that. So we're going to go to the hills and we're going to farm oak, sheep, pigs, we're going to do all that kind of stuff getting... I think we'll go for the furs though. Because I need to stockpile furs. I need to stockpile furs for, or uh, hides for um, when I start doing my tanning and stuff. And if I stockpile that while I'm out there getting my wood to finish my order, and which we're going to need a lot of wood to finish my order. I wish I could buy it real cheap. Let's see if anybody else sell. If I can get it cheap enough, I'll buy it. Because I can make money off of it. Did I call my... Yeah, my rat's been called. Now when this dissipates, the crab will pick up. Hey, how come I don't have as much life as I normally do? Oh, I know why. I don't want that. Let's unequip that. Well, I could keep that equipped, but it ain't gonna do me no good. Because my skills aren't there. Well, if I can't buy the oak wood, the next best thing is to gather it up. I don't know how many dowels I have because I didn't check, but I'm pretty close on the dowels, so. And I can make almost a grand off the dowels, which is good. It costs a little. It makes. To make dowels, if you don't have the skills and the materials, it costs like. I want to say. A thousand bucks to buy the dolls. We're going to check this NPC real quick and see how long before he will give me some more. And we're going to give these horns to the one NPC. Uh, how long before he will give me what is this? A soil sample container? Small area to hold dirt. Huh? What is that? Huh. Oh, it's a soil sample container. We'll drop that. Alright, we're going to talk to this guy real quick. We're going to go to shop and see if I can sell to him yet. No? Three days and three hours. Yuck. Training. Okay, we're not going to be able to make a lot of money here. Alright, let's see, let's gift. We want to give him these. That is going to put him over the top. Now we're going to do training. Teach me. There, I learned how to dance. And what is this? Basic Bard Horn. Oh, cool. Now I'm a bard. 
Bard level one. Good deal. I don't want to equip that just yet. We're gonna bring out my animal. And we're gonna head over there. There's some oak already, so we're gonna grab that. take anything we can get for money. Uh, let's go to nearby on the chat bar. Oak wood. We're gonna shoot this guy. Man, he does a lot of damage anymore. We're gonna butcher that. We want to gather mutton. We're gonna get pig hides off this guy, though. I should say rough hides or shabby hides, whatever it is. We'll get the mutton. We got mutton plus a rib bone. Good deal. Where is he? God, why does he not follow me sometimes? I hate that. Get over here, you dumb rat. Hey, that's 63 bucks I can make. We want the mutton. We'll take the mutton. I think that's like five mutton, yep. We're gonna kill everything we come up on because we want webs and legs from spiders because we can sell those in small increments for some money and I do need money real bad so My skill's high enough, I'm getting two skins every time I... Oh. Yeah, I'm getting two skins every time I do a pig, pretty much. That's good. Ooh, apples. We want the apples. Now right over in here usually is the start of the oak spawns, somewhere over here. I find quite a bit of oak over here usually. Good, we got some wool. If 
fire sheep will kill him. Good, we got some more of that. Um, get some mutton. And my skill is at 13, or not 13, 17, so that's good. Alright. I'm surprised we haven't seen more wood. What's attacking me? Take the cheese, skin the corpse. Take the salt, skin the corpse. It's, man, I'm getting two shabby hides a piece now. Where's my shabby hides? That's good. I like that. My skinning skill is good, so I'm getting bonuses. And I need shabby hides. To start my tanning off of. We want oak. That's the whole purpose we come out here. And there's some good. We're going to make our way to that. Good, we got chicken. We'll take venison while we're out here. I got no problem with that. We'll take the guts. Oh, I skinned it instead of grabbing the venison. My bad. We're going to skin that. Strawberries, we want the strawberries. Alright, we're gonna make our way this way because we want that oak. Oh, it's not oak. It looks like oak, but it's just a bunch of plants. Looks like oak wood, but it's just a bunch of plants. I hate that. I get all excited and then it's just that row of plants. Is that a row of plants? Yeah, it is. I want some oak. I'm not seeing any oak. I think I see some if there is some. It might be plants though. Usually boars, deer, tigers, grapes, and oak wood is over this way. Invalid target order. It's right there. I mean invalid target. Maybe 
Maybe I'll get some wild boar tusks. There's some wood. I see some two of them. So we're gonna head over there and grab those. What do you mean George doesn't have a valid target for that? Man, they still need to work out some bugs with this. Forgot to hit the, the. I hit the wrong button on him. That's fine. So there's more wood. There's more wood down here. Two more. Good. I need them. That's all I need, really. I think. No, I need one more. can fill I actually need a lot more than that but no one's selling oak wood so I'm just gonna have to put up with trying to get it myself oh great we'll grab them my inventory look like it's looking good animal handling went up I wonder how much venison is worth. Ten. I might buy some venison. See if I can't make some money off some people that hunt deer. Or want to make money hunting deer. I don't know. I'll have to wait till I have some more money though. Before I put in a buy order for that.
Let's go this way. There's so much I haven't explored in this game yet. Ooh, mushrooms, we want those. Pizza here pretty quick. Oh, they already do have it set up where you can get more venison and stuff. Oh, that's interesting. Or maybe they put it in when I suggested it. Probably didn't take long. I mean, just a little adjustment, really. Oh, he's running. Shoot this tiger. I can't wait till I start using better arrows. I'll really be doing damage then. We're gonna kill this pig. Two hams. Two shabby hides. Look at that. That's cool. Amulet of 15 max health, we'll take that. What's this? Armor. Oh, that's cool. Those will sell good. How much are those worth? 60 and 60. Oh, they ain't that big of a deal. I thought they had some other stuff on them. I can see why someone would drop them. <sighs> where are we at? So we're close to where we want to go. Man, my rat whoops his butt. Once our bond level on him. Check. Bond level, happiness, bond level's up. So I want my bond level to go up before I uh, level him up.
we're gonna go kill this sheep. That way we can get an XP boost. Oh, I didn't want the dirt. I don't really like dirt. I mean, it's useful, but I don't really like it. It's so cheap. Leveled up armor patching, good deal. 14 level, I need armor patching up to 20. Is that a player? Yeah, okay. Just a few more sheep and get some wool. How much mutton do we have? Where's my mutton? 20 mutton? That's not bad. I've been accidentally skinning some of them, so. How many shabby hides do we have? What are those? 41. Yeah, good deal. Apple tree, we'll take that. We're not using them. Man, you kill those so easily. Crude hide off from good deal. Ooh, two wood. Good. I'm glad I turned this way. Let's see, what's my skill at? Almost 28. 970 XP away from 28 on that. And this is... About 500 and... 7 XP from creature handling level 19. We want this sheep. cheese getting lots of cheese I think we're stacking cheese for a while here
Someone's down there. We want these mushrooms. Oh, where are we? We want to head this way. We're going to take a short break once we get to the one tune. The NPC in the one building. We're going to get some pizza and eat it. Oh, I think I got my wool. There's another sheep. We're going to go kill it. Two sheep right here. No, just one. I'm kind of curious where we learn to cook mutton. I have not found anything really on cooking mutton. Unless I already have it. Spiral eggs will take. I think we have enough. We can fill one of the industry orders. There's some more wood. That looks like some kind of spider. Good, we got some of that. Who was it that said the drop rate on those is slow? One of the guys in my clan, I've almost accumulated 14 in the past few days, so I don't think the drop rate is too slow in my opinion, but we're going to kill that. this okay, rat. oh looky there we got something else we can sell actually we're gonna check that real quick 56 that's a decent sell Dang it, I messed up twice. Take butcher. Alright. Man, I'm glad I woke up at 6 in the morning. I went to bed early about 11 30, 12 o'clock. Fell asleep real quick. Woke up about 3 o'clock. Went back to bed. Um, then I went and woke up about 6 15. Got up, took the dog out, started playing. I love utilizing my time properly instead of wasting my time. What is that? 179, that's nice. We might sell that to a player maybe. I keep forgetting to do these two things in this. I get hunting and I just go with it. I wish this. I should move this tab down here. That's what I should do. Oh, I just moved that. 
Uh, let's do skills. Dig deep to put it. Uh, move this up. Move this up. Deep deep to. There we go. There we go. Now we're gonna do dig deep this and this, and we're gonna kill this pig. Won't give us much XP, but we'll get something. I didn't get any armor for that. We're gonna skin that. Oh yeah, I did. Or maybe I didn't. I didn't see any armor patching. Do I not have any? Okay, I've got hammers. Or patching kits. This sheep will give us some good army patching. Alright, we're gonna click that, click that. There we go, now I got some armor patching and first aid. through that I think I can yes I can all right inventory let's check here we got a lot of jewelry too bad there wasn't another person to sell jewelry to what do we do? job here oh that's that okay let's talk oh we want to talk to this girl 500 bucks, sweet. Uh, can you tell me more about dancing, history? No, okay, the small task. Or small talk, do a favor, can't do any favors. But now I have 600 bucks, which is good. Okay, we're going to take a short break here and I'm going to get something to eat, guys. Almost out of soups, boy. I only got like six, seven cans. I'm gonna have to go buy more soup soon. And I gotta eat those beans and that chicken. Come here, honey. What's your problem, huh? Say hello to me. Say hello to me. What are you doing, huh? What are you doing, honey? Get down. Oh, pop bottles, pop bottles, pop bottles. We're saving up pop bottles, boy. Green peppers, ham, and onions smell good, boy. Just turn around here. Like that. That's going to be tasty. kitty food for you and I have to buy dog food for Buford. 
He's got a little house dog for you. I gotta buy kitty food for you, that's for sure. All right. Time to get some eats on here. Take a small break and eat. We got another heart. Got some venison, not a whole lot. Decent amount of mutton. Lots of pig meat. Lots of pig meat. Pork shoulders, I should say. I know what I'm going to do with that pig meat too. I'm going to cook it up. And I'm going to gift it. To Feynor. got just enough wood I can fill that order so I'm gonna fill that order and get my industry started I love pizza, Sam. Pizza. So good. I can get rid of my basic loot because now I have the bard skill and I have a bard level 1 loot I can use I've got two flint that I picked up. From earlier. I'm gonna craft some arrowheads out of them. And put them in storage. Move my other 80 arrowheads.
Yeah, that's beautiful. You're waiting patiently for that crust. I'll give you some. There you go, boy. Oh, that was a good pizza. I have two more pieces I can eat for lunch. I didn't eat breakfast, so I was pretty hungry. Breakfast pizza. Breakfast of champions. Alright. 51 shabby hides. That's not too bad. <laughs> Alright, we're going to head to Serbu. I need to get some stomachs. I need stomachs for a quest. I got two perfect oak. I need carpentry level 20 to use those. I think you can break them down into more of these, but I'm not sure what the perfect oak is for. Let's see here. This piece of oak is exemplary of its type. There are a few uses for this type of lumber, but often there is no need for such high quality. In that case, you can turn it into several pieces of typical wood. Ah, okay. So when I reach level 20, all this that I stockpile, I can break down into more of these if I need to. Which will be good. Let's sort that. I'm not sure I like the way they sort things. Let's see. Necklace. Get rid of. Sword damage. Heavy multi shot damage. That's cool. Uh, what am I wearing? 
five health. I want to keep a fire damage amulet, but I'm not. I, they're so. I'm gonna gift these all to her. Actually, I might want to keep that. Plus four to sword. No, I'll sell it. Or not sell it, but gift it. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. Where is the one that I... That's the one I want to keep. Oh, okay. I guess I'll, the only way to do it is drag and click. There is a character somewhere that takes wool, and that's pretty much all they'll take to get their favor up. I think it's the one in Cerebral, and there's another one. What is this? A shabby chair. Who made all these shabby chairs? <laughs> I can't pick them up. Too bad I couldn't pick them up. I can fill an order. Alright, we're gonna come in here. Crafting, tanning, leather crafting. Let's see here. Leather strips. Leather rolls. So I need rough tanning powder. Which means I'm gonna have to go to... Um, oh, where is it? Unless this guy gives it to me. No, that's a reading package code. Alright. I'm going to have to go get that. Alright, let's see here. Let's gift. What can we gift? He loves meat, but I'm not giving him my meat. Um, storage. We want this out. We want that in. That in. We want to put the cheese in. Um, what else do we want to put in? Maybe now we'll carry the wool with us. Oh, I still have my simple. S we'll put that in storage. I might make a new character and use that. Alright, what do we got here? We're gonna take and withdraw that. Withdraw that. Withdraw that. What happened to all my other hides? I had a whole bunch more hides. Oh, it doesn't stack them automatically. Okay. Not too bad to start with. Alright. Okay, anything else we want to put in there? We got one stomach. Alright, let's close that out. We're going to check her shop for used stuff.
a simple skinny knife. Oh, I kind of want to buy that. I kind of want to buy that to have it around for new characters. Not going to though. How much is that coin purse? No, we're not going to buy that. I don't see why people don't open those coin purses. They can't sell it for very much and they can get a lot more out of it, I think. Alright, that'll be good. Storage real quick. And I don't think there's anything I need to put in. Well, we're going to put that in. We're going to put... No, we're not. We're going to save that. Because we're going to Edibule. And that's where we learn how to do the magic stuff, I think. At least that's what I've been told by the NPC. But I haven't figured it out just yet. Maybe because I've gone to the wrong place. Alright. Alright. We want this out. We're going to put that right there. And bar damage negative one. That's okay. Okay, we've got that now. This classic loot we're going to sell. Let's see what we're going to sell here. What is this armor anyways? It's junk. Sell that. The pants, however, might be better. No, they're not. Why would I think they're better? Oh, because I was thinking of the other character. We'll sell the loot. Sell the pet sadist gloves. What are these gloves? No, we'll get rid of that. Did I sell my good loot? No, I didn't. That means I had two loots. I used. I sold the loot for a hundred. Classic loot. What is this one? Huh. Well, I sold that for a hundred. Do I need it though? No, probably not. Well, I'll take it. Because I don't want I don't know if I need it to level up or not. So, let's see what we can sell now. Okay, so I got my basic one, my classic loot, and I got this one. So that's good. Alright, hang out. What can I do for this guy? 30 minutes. 2 hours. Nah. We're going to come over here and store some of my food items now. You have 16 slots. That's good. Okay, storage. Alright, we're going to store the heart. Do I have apples I can store? What is this? Sulfur? 200. I can sell that for 200. Well, heck, let's withdraw that. Maybe I'll sell that. I've got a lot of grapes, a lot of mutton, a lot of venison now, 75 venison, put chicken in, put the mushrooms in, put the mushrooms in, strawberries, can I put those in? No, can't put apples in, hmm, 
I wish I had more storage, but I want to buy a slot. Although I could pull these onions out and get rid of those. Let's withdraw the onions. We're going to store the strawberries. We're going to leave the rest. And... Okay, I forgot to do something over at storage. The other storage area. Storage. Okay, perfect logs put in. I've got eight of those. So we're close on that order. Work order for trophies, trophies. <laughs> Alright. Let's come to crafting. We're going to go to carpentry we're going to do wood we're going to do all of them all right now we have one order filled all right we're gonna go over here actually here first. Oh, he's down here. Uh, give gift. We'll give him the rat tails. The ribs. No, we're not going to. We'll give him the rat tails, but we're not going to give him anything else. We're going to come over here and sell that stuff because we need some money. And I haven't sold a lot to this guy lately. So we're going to go to shop, sell. I can still get 300 from him. Sell, 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 sell. So we got a thousand bucks. Now we're doing not too bad. Gift. Anything I can gift? Well, we'll gift him that. And we'll gift him the flint. No, we're going to keep the flint. We're going to make. I forgot about that. What is that? Rotten strawberry. I should pick that up. But I don't want to have it in my inventory space. Alright, we're going to go crafting, we want to go to fletching, we want to do arrowheads, two. Alright, now we want to come over here, and go to storage. Uh, Myrna, is she the one? Yep, we're going to put those in storage. As you can see, I have excess crafted beginner arrows. I crafted 10k worth of those because I thought I had a um, work order for them, but I had basic arrow work order. You know what? Time has passed, and I didn't go buy those work orders, did I? No, I did buy those work orders. So, uh, beginner long arrows, I think I can do, if I get two more, four more, uh, yeah, four more, uh, oak, I can do, actually, no, two more, two more oak, and I can do ten grand of those, I think I can sell those, because I'm not going to be using them too much as of right now, but I think I can do a work order for those, I'm going to look real quick. Uh, not their uh, quest work order oh I don't have it I don't have it shoot I forgot to buy it that's okay that's okay we'll just hold on to it for now I really want to do this one though because I can make that much money so that's the one I want to do but I got to get my fletching skill up basic arrow recipe actually we're gonna see if we can uh,
we're gonna see about training here basic arrow shaft I need three more levels to make those oh so those dowels I made are gonna be oh I see the dowels are what changes the arrow that makes sense though it's not the head of the arrow let's see what we have we can give the gift do we want to give that um, we've got two we'll give that one this one we're gonna hold on to I think until we use our staff so we're gonna put this no we'll just leave it right there all right everything's good I've got a thousand bucks we're gonna go turn in these we're gonna put one of them back into our uh, area here our storage along with the sulfur we're gonna sell the onions because no I don't want to sell the onions do I really I don't know I could sell them and make a little bit of money I'm I mean I need money so and that's about 90 money that I can sell them for I think I'm not sure I think it's nine um for an onion to buy and you make one penny off of it or one coin one console we'll see here we'll check real quick all right shop yeah a seedling cost nine and you can sell them for ten so whoop the freaking do if you make something out of them though you can make a lot more I can sell those for 12 each to a player I'll save those I've been selling those like crazy should I sell that I'm gonna hold on to the onions I might be able to use them to make like hash browns or something like that or something and make a little bit more money what did this do oh that's nice Oh, I need to eat. All right, we're gonna eat this. Uh, we might want to be stationary, and we'll eat the flatbread. All right, there we go. So we're not doing too bad. We want to go to Edbule after we take these to where we're headed. That'll give us another 148 and give us a little bit of industry. And then I think we're going to take a short break and uh, relax for a little bit before we do any more work. Just take a break. What, buddy? What? You don't whine, but no, you're not getting pizza. You had enough. You're not getting any more. Beat the pups, but what are you doing, Mister? What are you doing, Mister? Hey, get down off my cord! I don't want you on my cord. We're gonna get this clownfish. Can we get this fish? Oh, nope! I need four fishing level to get it. I can't get the great fish, but I can get the clownfish. Maybe we'll do some fishing instead of getting off. get my fishing skill up I do want to take a breather though just 
just a short one, 15, 20 minutes. Delivery for Bulkman. Ooh, let's kill that tiger. We're gonna summon my pet. We're level 19 pet handling skill. Maybe I'll kill tigers for a while. I was gonna go do some uh, um, tanning and stuff, but I wanted to just take a short break and just relax for a little bit so I'll probably take a 10 15 20 minute break after I do this uh, boatman quest here real quick fill this order in and then we're gonna go ahead and we'll hunt a while and get some more uh, pelts till we're stocked up on crudes and and roughs and even more shabbies and then we'll head to Edibule and we'll try and do the fire magic and some of that uh, tanning. Industry level one. We're actually, we're going to check the postings right now and see if there's anything I want to pick up. There might be, I might be able to still get something like that arrow one. Hour and 58 minutes. Let's see, meditation stools. Shabby ones, super shabby carpentry, trophy rat skinning. I haven't been able to do that at all. I haven't gotten one trophy. Uh, order of onion rings. I could do that. Let's see what it pays. Nine thirty-four. Ten onion rings. I think I can cook onion rings too. No, I can't. I did not get it. So we'll hold off on that. Fried bites. Uh, I'd like to do that, but I can't. Soft boiled eggs. No. So let's see here. There's not much I can do besides maybe the, the stool. That's about it. I can do. I can't do this really yet. Settle down, boy. Quit your whining. There's none of these that I can actually do, so before we log off, we're going to head back to town real quick here, and we're going to do maybe a 30-minute, uh, yeah, we'll do a 30-minute um, to an hour, um, what you want to call it, uh, what is going on there? A 30-minute to an hour, um, a uh, hangout quest to get some favor and stuff. We'll do a 30 minute one because I saw a 30 minute one and we'll do that with um, Joel. Joa, Joa, I think his name is. Joa. And we'll do that and we'll take 30 minutes. So we'll do that. Industry levels level one. Now that it's level one, I can actually see its progression. Okay, uh, skills, industry, industry, we'll kill that tiger. I need 20 for level 2, that's not bad. That's easy. Oh, we can take on three tigers with my buddy with me. Hopefully we get some skins here. One crude skin. We'll take the venison. We'll get crude skin and an eyeball. And we'll take that and we'll get... We got three crude skins. That is really cool. Those are... 20 value, so I mean that's 60 bucks right there. But I can use these in crafting, so that's what I plan on doing. So 
So we're gonna log off for a little bit. Am I live streaming or am I? No, I'm not live streaming. I'm just doing a video. So, okay. So we're gonna call this video good. Um, like, subscribe, comment. Um, let me know what you think of this game. I'm really enjoying it. I like the game. I like how it's put together. I'm noticing more and more things about it as I play it longer. S some things I thought they should add are already in. Um, I don't know if they've added them briefly because they check the comments every day when you make suggestions. So, um, And it's probably just a simple coding to do some of that stuff. So, And they've worked on it a long time so they know what they're doing. So, Anyways, um, I will chat at you guys later. Have a good evening.